What would occur if Earth orbited Proxima Centauri rather than the Sun? Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf that is smaller and cooler than the Sun, but has greater solar activity and emits more radiation. Could life as we know it exist if the Earth orbited this star rather than the Sun? Let's discover. Hello everyone, welcome back, you are watching Z, the Space Fanatics. Subscribe to the channel and ring the bell so you don't miss any update. Proxima Centauri is located 4.24 light-years from our solar system and is the closest known star. This star is so small that it is only 12% the size of the Sun and emits only a fraction of the Sun's radiation. This indicates that if the Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri, it would receive significantly less radiation and heat than it does from the Sun. This would have massive implications for our biosphere and planet. Temperature would be the first obstacle we would confront. If Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri, the planet would be considerably frigid than it is currently. The average temperature on Earth is 59 degrees Fahrenheit or 15 degrees Celsius, while the average temperature in the habitable zone surrounding Proxima Centauri is minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 40 degrees Celsius. At these temperatures, Earth would be frozen and probably uninhabitable for life as we know it. Radiation would be the second concern we would face. Red dwarf stars, such as Proxima Centauri, are known to emanate intense solar flares and radiation that can threaten the existence of life on nearby planets. If Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri, it would be subjected to these solar flares and a greater quantity of radiation, which could be hazardous to life on Earth. The third issue would be the absence of illumination. Because Proxima Centauri is considerably less luminous than the Sun, the Earth would receive significantly less light and energy from it. This could have an impact on photosynthesis in plants, which would propagate through the food chain. Moreover, a lack of sunlight can influence our mood and overall health, in addition to our visibility. Our pupils have adapted to detect the spectrum of light that the sun emits. In contrast, the spectrum of light emitted by Proxima Centauri is dominated by colors close to red. If we orbit this star, we may not perceive colors on Earth, where blue predominates. It is possible that our night vision would also be affected, as the light emitted by stars near Proxima Centauri would differ from the light from Alpha Centauri and Alpha Centauri B that we see in the night sky today. Exists any remedy for these issues? Earth's proximity to Proxima Centauri could be one potential solution. If Earth were only 0.05 astronomical units from Proxima Centauri, its temperature would be similar to what it is now and it would still be within the habitable zone. However, this would also expose the Earth to the intense radiation and solar flares emitted by the Red Dwarf. By filling the Earth's atmosphere with greenhouse gases such as methane, it would be possible to create a much denser atmosphere capable of trapping heat and protecting life from radiation. Although this is detrimental in the modern era, if the Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri, it could be a viable strategy for combating heat and radiation. As methane is a very heavy gas, increasing its concentration would increase atmospheric pressure and reduce the quantity of oxygen available to living organisms. The Results of Circling a Red Dwarf In addition to the previously mentioned effects, we must also consider those that are readily apparent, such as hue. If the Earth orbited the star Proxima Centauri instead of the Sun, what hue would the sky be? Certainly, the color of the sky would differ from what we see on Earth. Because Proxima Centauri is a red star and emanates most of its light in the infrared spectrum, the sky appears significantly darker and redder than on Earth during the day. On Earth, the sky is blue because gases in the atmosphere, such as oxygen and nitrogen, capture photons of this color and bounce them off each other until they reach the ground, resulting in the sky being dominated by this color. However, on Proxima Centauri, these hues are not as prevalent, if we also altered the composition of the atmosphere's molecules, the sky would take on hues such as pink and orange. Forget the typical blue sky that we are acclimated to seeing. Also, forget about experiencing the heat of the sun's rays, as Proxima Centauri is much colder and smaller than the sun, it would appear as a dark red dot in the sky, rather than a giant sphere of luminescent light. If Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri, would there be life? It is difficult to say whether life would exist on Earth if it orbited Proxima Centauri, but it is unlikely that life as we know it could persist in those conditions. 
Over billions of years, life on Earth has evolved under specific conditions, including favorable temperature, atmospheric pressure, radiation, and light. If conditions are drastically different from those we know, it is unlikely that life will persist. At least for life as we know it, it would be necessary to determine if other forms of life can persist in these radically different environments. In addition to the effects on temperature and atmospheric pressure, the Earth's orbit around Proxima Centauri would alter the duration of our planet's days and years. Due to the fact that Proxima Centauri is a much smaller and less massive star than the Sun, the Earth would need to be much closer to it to be within its habitable zone. This means that the Earth's orbit would be significantly shorter, and the days and years would be shorter than they are today. For example, if Earth were at the same distance from Proxima Centauri as it is from the Sun, its orbital period would be approximately 11.2 Earth days instead of the current 365 Earth days. Yes, as you have just heard, it would take the Earth only 11.2 days to orbit the Sun, or, to be more precise, 11.2 days to orbit Proxima Centauri. This implies that a year and the seasons would be significantly shorter, if they existed at all, since, given the paucity of the years, it is highly unlikely that there are seasons. On the other hand, the days would be approximately 50 Earth days in length, as the planet's proximity to its star would exert a gravitational pull on the planet's surface, slowing its rotation and extending the days. A day would be longer than a year if the Earth orbited Proxima Centauri. On Venus, the only planet in our solar system where a day lasts longer than a year, the same phenomenon occurs. Unpredictable Outcomes In addition, it is known that Proxima Centauri has highly variable solar activity, with frequent solar eruptions and solar flares that can emit high levels of radiation. This solar activity could harm Earth's atmosphere and living organisms, particularly if the planet were much closer to the star. This may impact the likelihood of life developing on a planet in the habitable zone surrounding Proxima Centauri. However, this is dependent on the planet's specific conditions and atmosphere. Tidal coupling is another phenomenon that would occur if the Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri. Tidal coupling is the phenomenon in which an object's rotation is synchronized with its orbital motion, such that it always has the same side facing the star. For example, the Moon orbits the Earth in this manner. It takes the Moon the same amount of time to orbit the Earth as it does to orbit itself, its period of rotation and translation are identical, which is why we always see the same side of the Moon. If the Earth were in the habitable zone of Proxima Centauri, tidal coupling could occur. This would result in one side of the Earth always facing the star and the other always being in darkness. This would have a significant impact on the planet's climate and life, as one side would be exposed to radiation and heat from the star, while the other would be thrust into darkness and freezing temperatures. Regarding the preservation of the Earth's atmosphere, it is true that Proxima Centauri solar activity could be detrimental. Solar flares and solar eruptions can generate solar winds that can travel through a planet's atmosphere, particularly if the planet lacks a magnetic field like Earth. However, it is not impossible for the Earth to retain its atmosphere while in orbit around Proxima Centauri, particularly if it had a powerful magnetic field and a dense atmosphere. In addition, the precise distance between Earth and the star, as well as the conditions of the planet's atmosphere and magnetosphere, would be crucial for the conservation of the atmosphere. A Distinct Atmosphere If Earth were to orbit Proxima Centauri, the night sky stars would look different than they do now. Proxima Centauri is part of the Centauri star system and is located in the constellation Centaurus. This system also includes Alpha Centauri and Alpha Centauri b, two stars that orbit one another about a common mass center. Finally, Proxima Centauri orbits around these two stars. If we were on Proxima Centauri, the nearest star to Alpha Centauri a and b, these two stars would appear as a singular bright point. Alpha Centauri A and B are extraordinarily similar to the Sun in mass and spectral type, indicating that they would emit visible light in the same wavelength range as the Sun. In terms of luminosity and hue, Alpha Centauri A and B would appear very similar to the Sun from Earth, but they would appear much smaller due to their great distance. From the perspective of Proxima Centauri, they would not be luminous enough to significantly illuminate the planet and make the daytime significantly brighter than on Earth. In general, the quantity of light we would receive from these stars would be negligible compared to that of the Sun. In addition, due to the Earth's shifting position in space, the nighttime constellations would be different. 
If the Earth were to migrate to a different location in space, the constellations we observe would also change. The possibility of the Earth orbiting another star, such as Proxima Centauri, makes us appreciate how fortunate we are to live on this gorgeous planet. Although it is physically impossible for modern science to transport Earth to another solar system, the concept inspires us to value our imagination. Moreover, it recognizes the singularity and grandeur of our home in the universe. Exploring the possibility of Earth orbiting another star ultimately enhances our appreciation for the vastness of the universe and the significance of protecting the planet. It encourages us to consider our place in the universe and motivates us to work together to preserve and protect our one and only home in the universe. Alright guys, this video ends here, thanks for watching. What are your thoughts? Is there anything you like to say? Tell us in the comments, and don't forget to like, share and subscribe.